people welcome back to week two of our exercise one month routine challenge we are doing a upper body variation and that is our focus for this month so we are going to be changing things up a little bit this week let us pray and then i'll tell you about it father we thank you for taking us to week two we pray that you'll give us all the strength and endurance of mind and body and spirit that we need to complete this routine with flying colors and excellent results in jesus name we pray amen thank you for joining me this morning again for those who are coming for the first time welcome to escape family here we work escape forever free family here we work together to restore physical mental spiritual and social wholeness all right so this morning's routine we are going to be focusing on this week rather a little bit of a change up so for this first for the first two days in this week we will be doing our arms and our back so we're going to be having day one and two focusing on our arms and then day three and four focusing on our backs then the following week um we will be doing our chest and abs i have not given you the ad the abs move yet so you'll get those for the following week and then in our last week of the month we're going to double up on each of those for the last weeks i'll tell you how don't worry about it now so for today grab your weights you're going to need some weights for today's routine and get your water i'll give you the moves get your music as well and let us get into this remember we sip throughout our routine we're going to warm up you're going to double the moves that we do together on your own and then you're going to cool down on your own and do not skip any step let's get to it all right so we'll start out with some water and let me just remind you of the moves for your arm so we're going to be doing our overhead triceps we're going to be doing our curls with over with shoulder arm lift we're going to be doing our kneeling push-ups and we're going to be doing our relay reach triceps there are some things that we did last week as well that need some correction for form especially our push-up the form was horrible that i demonstrated so i'm going to be trying to improve on that and one advice is to try and kind of curve our backs when we're going down for that chest um dip and to come back up we try to keep our form as much as possible in the back my back has a natural um curve right there so it's kind of very um challenging to to control but pay attention to your body form and correct and have the most controlled um center movement in your back as much as you can when you're doing the push-ups so let's do this all right water is in and we're going to start warming up let me change that view a little bit for you and we begin all right so going from the top getting those shoulders ready all right so work it in the back rotate it shoulder over shoulder of course all this time you are breathing real deep to change keep that form keep the core steady as you can let's do some stretching out the legs go in the back the leg in the back goes behind you automatically and your neck is looking over shoulder all right let's change that next arm stretch all right we're going to go down to our waist our waist of course you know this is more intense routine even though we're doing it in small doses it is up a couple levels after this month and the following months two months time routine we're going to be in we're going to be increasing our weight so if you're doing five pounds now i'm going to ask you to get 10 pounds ready for the next two months and if you're doing 10 pounds you might want to put five to some amount of additional pounds on it so we can challenge our endurance and intensify the tempo of what we're doing stretch that up more legs to the side stretching the weights while we're at it up grab the next one to the side kind of left arm is in the back all right stretch up let's stretch out a little bit so get your weights ready if you don't have them yet if you're building them at home you need to increase the size of that bottle increase the amount of sand whatever you're using for your weight training we want to increase that over the next two months so when this month is done we have one more month with this rate that we've been using after which we're going to add to our weights all right so we're going to tone those muscles with some more intensity of course for the woman we do not want to look muscular we only want to be toned but for the men of course you can even start your increase of weight right now because already these sets of routine 
are intensified. So if you want to bulk up a little bit more, if that's your thing, then this is a good time to increase your weight for those who are males and are following us. All right. Let's rotate the waist. Rotate. Now this time you are breathing. All right. Keep it. Let's increase a little bit the pace. Inhale, exhale, please. Real deep. All right, good job. Let's grab it in the back, that leg in the back and balance forward again. Hold. Good job, return. Next, forward. Hold. Return. Good job, you're doing good. All right, keep it moving, keep it moving. All right, rotate those shoulders some more. Change direction. Good job, good job, good job. All right, let's do some apart together and get the heart involved in this warm up. So we call it jumping jacks on other sides of the world. Change. Let's get that direction right. So we're here. Change. All this time, you are breathing. Change. See, I'm taking it nice and slow for you. Change. Change. Breathe real deep, guys. Breathe. Oxygenate that blood. Good job. All right, so we're done with that right there. It was worth it. It was worth it. Let us go to our ankle as we calm the heart down a little bit. Rotate, step back one more. Change. Change. Good job, good job. Let's do some quick dips. Arms extend as you go down. Some real quick squats. No, this time you are still breathing. All right, so we're just gonna do a little bit of our jogging on the spot, and that will take care of warming up for us. Heart is pumping, blood is flowing quite nice and warm around the body. Circulation blood is going on good, and that same blood is nicely oxygenated. If you're doing this at home, at home, make sure you have your windows open. Please, if you have vents that are optional, allow air to come in as you do your routine. Very important. Change. Change. All this time you're breathing quite deep. Change. Keep that tempo. Pace yourself. You're in the race. You're well ahead. And you're in the lead. Change. Yes, guys, I love to run. I used to be an athlete, so running is quite a good part of my sport. Change. Stretch. Backward. Keep that form. Backward more. Backward more. Return to the front, stretch, up, 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 and up to the side, and we're done. All this time, you're still breathing. Good job, guys. Now we're ready for our routine. You did the first half of this already. Now let's get into the second half of today's routine. Get some water in. Good job guys so now we're going to start our workout for today with some overhead triceps so let's get our mat get you some view and get going you've chosen your music and you're ready for this 
make sure you can see what's going on right here on the map quite well good job so there we go so we're going to be going here take that up a notch since we're doing the overhead right now so we're getting down right here all right oh, i'm a little bit too tall for this view so let's pump it up a little bit more for you there we go all right so we have our weight in the hand and we're going to be doing our overhead triceps so we'll go like so we'll even come a little bit closer for you all right so here we're toning up the triceps with this move i'm doing it kneeling down if you want to stand you can choose to stand all right so here we go all right so we go from behind we bend keep an angle like so all right so we're going to be toning those strides so we do straighten relax straighten relax breathe as you do this three four keep the rest of your form as steady as you can five make sure that weight is not hitting your spine anywhere on your neck there seven eight nine you want to keep this angle as firm as you can as you make all the moves so you can get the toning going on one for grace so that's one set and we're doing three all right change the, the um the view on that for you let me change your view a little bit again all right not so much so but so all right so here we go once more we're kneeling down all right so bend ready straighten two keep that form in the core three allow the arms to do the work four keep that angle on the arm five so the toning takes place in the tricep six seven eight nine ten give you some more up of you on that we have one more to go in this set as we're doing three in the set okay ready for more so here we go give you a side view one not good do a front view two three four keep the angle with the bent arm keep it so you can feel the burn seven eight nine ten make sure you're not going all the way down see like so so you feel that burn keep it hanging all right like about here right and then you return nine one for grace okay all right so that takes care of the tricep right there of course we'll be doing more than one of those so we finish with that we're going to move on now to our second one in the routine which is going to be our curls so we're going to be getting up is that view good enough for you we're going to be getting our weights again all right stand with your feet apart all right you don't want anything impeding let's get this mat out of the way so both legs are at the same level on the floor all right legs apart for balance all right get a form take your weight in hand and let's curl ready let's do it one and our curl of course is a variation and we're going up after we curl change two control your movement this is always focus and form and not speed because that's how we get these toning in control the weight going up hold on tight to that weight and control it coming back down it's three tone those muscles the right way all this time you're breathing four so of course we're going to repeat this on day two so our muscles get a fair amount of toning on each set that we do for our different 
upper body parts. All right, six. Keep that form. Seven. Eight. Squeeze. Nine. Control. Squeeze. Ten. Control. One. Four. Grace. Control and squeeze. All right, so that marks number one in our first set. Of course, we're doing three. Shake that out a little bit. If you want, you could put the weights down to rest your arms. I like to keep them in my hand to keep the toning going. All right, we're going in for three, for two now. Two of three. Are you ready? Let's get some water first. And all this time, we're breathing deep. Water in. Your second best friend next to breathing in all of your routines. Let's go. Legs apart. Find a balance. Arms at the side. Fully extend them. We'll kind of like front side. Hold on to your weight with your palms turned like so in the front. Facing out. And let's curl. One. See that? Turn around. And up. Return. Turn around. Release. On track and two repeat continue for three three four five hold on tight keep that form relax lengthen contract Six, lengthen, contract, seven, lengthen, curl, eight, control, lengthen, curl, nine, release, contract, keep that form, no swinging, no swing, ten, Lengthen, curl, one, release, for grace, extend, return, turn over, lengthen, and that would make ten, we're going to relax again, so go in for number three, shake that out, shake that out, and we've got one more to go, for number three, in this round. Are you ready? Let's do this again. Here we go. Ready? One, the first set. Two. Three. Four. Five. Hold firm, not too much squeezing, but hold firm. Six, keep that form in the center, well steady, well aligned. Seven, money wreck, no bending in the back, no crouching. Eight, Curl. Nine. Keep your form. Ten. Keep your form. Control. And one. Smile it out while you're breathing. For grace. Good job. All right. And that marks the last one in that set. All right. Shake that out. Shake that out. Shake that out. All right. So we're done with that for that set. Of course, you know we're going to double all this when we're done. So that's three. And let's move on now to do number three in our routine. 
which is going to be our kneeling push-ups. I don't think we did it all that good the last time. Well, I didn't. So we're going to be trying to improve on that. I'm going to give you kind of like a slanted view to give you as much view as possible. And of course, we're going to have to try and control the curve in our backs when we're going down. So let's see how much better we can do this time around. All right. Let's change your view. Let's see how much you can see right here. Good. So this is us. We're about to begin. Let's give you some more on that. All right. So here we go. Ready? Let's get this out a little bit more. So this is it. So we're on our knees. All right. Our hands, our arms are turned like so. They're under our shoulders, basically. All right. And they're there to keep us balanced and to bear the weight for what we're about to do. When we're going down, it's okay for our feet to leave the ground in support. And we're going to curve as best as we can our back to keep it in an aligned position. We don't want too much dipping like so. All right, even though my back tends to naturally have that curve. So let's go and keep that form. And the weight bearing is supposed to be happening on the arms and in the chest. Here we go. Ready? Let's do our best. One. Two. Use that arm to bring the body up. Three. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, stretch that out a little bit. We have two more to go. You can do this, guys. Ready for number two? Let's set up and get it done. Ready? Arms are ready. Back is ready. Now let's let's do this. All right. So ready. Let's go. Dip. One. Two. Four. Arms are working. Chest is working. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, Ooh. one, ah. two, Ooh. three. Ah. This is one way we know that last week we didn't get it right because we had no such pain. Stretch that out, stretch that out. And let's go in now for number three. Relax the arms a little bit. Relax them. And let's go. Position. Kneeling. Feet together at the side. All right. And we're going in for the last in this set. We can do this, guys. See? I'm right here with you. We can do this. Let's go. Ready? that back as best as we can before we go let's go one return two three Ooh. it's like your chest is going down in the front and you're returning it with your arms four Ooh. five Ooh. rest if you need to let me six Seven. Ooh. Rest. One. Ooh. Push up. Two. Ooh. Let's go. Three. Ooh. Okay, that marks ten. And it was not an easy ten. Let's get up. Stretch that out. Arms above. Flap them in and out. That was some work. All right. Let's continue to stretch that out. All right. 
Stretch it out some more on this side. All this time you're breathing. Your second, your best, best, best exercise pal is with you. You're breathing, so breathe deep. Scissors cut that out. Move this mat out the way, which causes us to be feeling so much arm tension right now. Well, it's good. In the end, we're going to love the tone that we get in our upper arms and our lower arms. Let's drink some water. There you have it. Our second best friend is with us. So, last one in this round of the routine, we're going to be doing our Rene triceps. So we're going to take our weight and we're going to reach behind. Last week we did not get that too perfectly either. So we're going to be trying to fix that now as well. So with our tricep reach, we want to keep our weight at an angle, right? And our arms at an angle. So we do not want to go as high as we were going last week. I kind of want you to act like you're on a pendulum and you just swing back at an angle. Keep that angle all the way, right? So that the tricep can do the work and will not be bypassed by a long stretch. All right, so here we go. Let's position and begin. Position, step forward as if you're gonna start a race. And let's start. Ready? Hold this weight in your hand for toning and let's go. One, two, three, four. Keep that angle. So when you come back, we wanna be at the same angle backward, forward, so we don't want this. We don't want this. So this is the angle, all right? Two, four. All right, keep that angle. Five, six, seven. So low movement of that angle as much as we can. Nine, ten, and one for grace. All right, so we're going to change arms. Let's go. Get that angle. Ready? Here we go. One, keep the angle. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, for grace. We're changing over. We're not resting yet. We're keeping the ten intensity up. So let's change and go to the next arm immediately. Position to run and let's go. Reach. One, two, keep that angle. Three. Keep it up there, shoulder height, four, as much as you can, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, one, for grace. We're going in for two on the next arm, ready, let's go, position, one, two, three, Four, five, six, keep that angle, seven, eight, look ahead, nine, ten, one, for grace. Woo! All right, so we've got one more to go. Let's get some of that sweat out of our eyes, relax those muscles, and let's keep it moving. All right, so let's get that done and move on. All right, so here we go. We've got one more to go in this set, and then we're going to double everything. All right, so let's position. Ready? For the race. Let's do this. One, keep that angle. Two, three, four, five. Keep the angle. See that angle? The 90 degree right there. Ten. 11, 12, for grace. Change, ready? Next one, position. Let's go, angle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, one, for grace. All right, so we did it and we did it right this time. So we can feel our shoulders 
and our biceps toning in on this move. And so there we have it. We have done all of the moves in our routine. So now we're going to go ahead and double everything on your own. So you've got to do your overhead triceps. You gotta do your curls with shoulder lifts. You gotta do your kneeling push-ups the right way. Curve your back, keep control of your back. And you're going to do your relay reach for the, um, the triceps. You've been doing so good so far. Keep the sipping going, double that routine, and please, cool down. Father, we thank you for taking us through this routine so far. Continue to guide us and give us strength and endurance, we pray, as you make our bodies whole again in your precious name as a gift to us for faith that we are stepping out in these works. In Jesus' name, amen. Let the words of our mouth and the meditation of our hearts be acceptable in thy sight, O Lord, our strength and our redeemer. Amen. Walk good. But above all, walk with God. See you on day two. Go ahead. Double up, cool down. God bless you.